Hello everyone and welcome. If you were using a older version of FFmpeg on your Windows computer and want to update your FFmpeg to the latest version, then this video is for you because in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to update existing FFmpeg with the latest one. Okay, so let's dive into that. First of all, uh, if you want to update your FFmpeg, then you have to know where you have saved your ffmpeg and added the environment path so let's first check my current version of ffmpeg for your example i'm opening terminal and typing ffmpeg minus so here the version of my ffmpeg is this one and 10 13 67 okay if i want to update this with the latest one then what i have to do is i have to go to the ffmpeg website first i have searched on google with ffmpeg going to their website then i'm navigating to download and here on windows build i'm going to windows build from guyan.dev and here scrolling down and under link section i am downloading this ffmpeg git full.7z zip file ok so after clicking on that i am saving this file on my download folder and waiting for it to complete the download now my ffmpeg download is complete so i am going to the containing folder and this is the zip file zip 7z file i am extracting with my pre-installed 7z software and copying all the files inside now i have to go to the directory where i previously saved my ffmpeg files so in my case that is on c and ffmpeg so inside that first i'm selecting on and deleting them and then pasting here the new files so if you want to do this risk free then you can cut the previous files and paste them to a different directory so that if something goes wrong you can restore them or you can restore them also from recycle bin so now here I'm creating a folder name old ffmpeg and moving previous ffmpeg file to my old ffmpeg folder now again copying the new ffmpeg files and pasting them on my ffmpeg folder here so that's all since i have previously added this directory to my environment variable my environment variable i previously added so i don't have to do anything more i just need to check so previously my version was n 10 13 6 7 so if i press the command again the newer version will be ffmpeg git 3 e 12 7 b something so this is a newer version if you are currently using a very old version which which not containing some newer feature then in this way you can have the latest version of your ffmpeg so that's all from this video please consider subscribing to my channel so i can continue making more helpful content for you guys thank you so much please like this video and subscribe if you didn't i'll see you in the next tutorial